People living with HIV and AIDS in McLennan County say stigma and discrimination have them feeling shut out from the rest of their community. They say the lack of support groups in the area really makes it even harder to live with the disease. Channel 6 News reporter Jasmine Caldwell is in studio to explain what they'd like to see change. Jasmine. Well, Doug and Leslie, just talking about HIV and AIDS is still very hard for some people to do, and the fear of both the virus and the disease causes many people to feel isolated. Now, one man I spoke to was diagnosed with HIV three years ago. He didn't want to show his face on camera, but told me he wishes there was more community support groups in McLennan County. He says he's doing all he can to use social media as a way to mentor and help newly diagnosed people cope, but he thinks more resources and funding would have an impact on a larger group. Usually when someone's diagnosed with HIV, immediately the first instinct is, I'm, I'm alone, I'm going to die alone. But when you start to meet others around, especially local, it brings that sense of community and it kind of lightens the blow just a tad bit. Now, according to the McLennan County Health Department, there is only one church on record that's dedicated to serving people who are living with HIV and AIDS as well as their families. Now, coming up after the Olympics, I spoke to the reverend of that church and he explained why he believes so many people are not stepping up in effort to help this community. Doug and Leslie. All right, Jasmine, thanks so much.